Station. Hey, Bert, look who's here. Hmm? Oh, great. Now we can get started. Come on, let's go. Bert and Ernie's Imagination Adventure. Let's go on an adventure with our imaginations. In the sky, in the tub, on the moon, or way back in time. Press the red button to play a learning adventure. Crabman yes, from Crabman Gaming button. here, and today I am playing Sesame Street, Bert and Annie's Imagination Crabby. Adventure. I might always check out the Those options first. Around the options are music on or off. So let's get cracking on the learning adventure. To play Pigeon Garden, press the red button. To play Rubber Ducky World, press the yellow button. To play Moonwalker, press the blue button. To play Dinosaur Island, press the green button. And we will indeed play all four of those, but let's get started in the Pigeon Come Garden. On, let's go! Bill Laurie's favorite. Look, it's Pigeon Garden. Wow! <laughs> now Sesame Street first aired. Help Bert find his clothespins. Please do! All the way back in 1969. Let's go! Use your joystick. And I'll try not to talk over the top of Bert and Ernie, but sometimes I can't help it. There's another close pin peg. Close pin, but in Australia we just call them pegs. So I might just call them pegs. But anyway, Sesame Street has now been running for 52 seasons, which is absolutely incredible. I had a little practice for about five minutes of this game and I did find jumping moves your character a little bit quicker. Uh, moves Ernie there a bit quicker and Bert kind of follows you around, so I may do a bit of jumping in this game. Great. So as I was saying Look, before, a pigeon coop. 52 seasons, 4,591 episodes as there of recording. There is one pigeon in the coop. The coop needs three pigeons altogether. To add one pigeon, press the red button. If you think you have the right number of pigeons, press the big enter button, one. There are two pigeons in the coop, one. There are three pigeons in the coop. If Hooray! There are three pigeons in the coop. All right, off we go again into... Seems to be like a hot air balloon with no, um, with no hot air on the top. Come on, let's go! But this game in my series, even though strangely it's called Sesame Street, Bert and Ernie's Imagination Adventure, is the eighth V Smile game on the list. That uh, comes just after Batman, which I don't have at the moment, and Blue's Clues, which will be the next video released, so you can check out the Crabman V Tech V Smile playlist if you'd like to see some more games. So even though it, the game really technically is Sesame Street, Bert and Ernie's Adventure, it'll be early on in my playlist. More pigeon counting. Look, a pigeon coop. There are three pigeons in the coop. The coop needs one. There are four pigeons in the coop. If You got it. There are four pigeons in the coop. So it's just amazing how long Sesame Street's been going. Like, I remember watching Sesame Street as a kid, just loving all the characters on Cookie Monster, Big Bird, Bert and Ernie. Come on, let's go! I tried to look up the list, but there was about a hundred characters, so I didn't know all of them. Oscar the Grouch. Just keep jumping away. Hopefully that's not too loud and obtrusive it's for you. I do tend to listen to them back on my PC and then the sound's pretty good and then sometimes on my TV it sounds a bit weird. Hey look Bert, it's a clothespin. I'll get it for you. Thank you. 
and as well Sesame Street was the first preschool educational TV program to base its contents and production values on laboratory and formative research. So they researched what, you know, preschools were interested in, what held their attention, what helped them learn, and then put it into the hour-long TV show. And 52 years later, it's still going. And could bring us this amazing V-Smile game. You gotta jump over the clothes. Well, I think Look, that, a pigeon coop. I think that's what they are. One lonely pigeon. Bill Laurie loves his pigeons, famous Australian. There is one pigeon in the coop. Cricketer. He needs two pigeons. All one. And commentator. There are two pigeons in the coop. You got it. There are two pigeons in the coop. Where did the trumpet come from? Anyway, more jumping. Thank you. Bit of crisscross. Jump, jump, jump. The daddy Mac will make you jump, jump. Oh, Mac daddy oh, will make you oh. jump, jump. A clothespin. A peg. It's a peg. And so the show was well being an hour long, focused on fast moving action, humor, and music to keep preschoolers entertained as well. Because an hour is a long time to try and keep Great. a three or four year old entertained. It's a long time to keep anyone entertained. Hopefully you'll watch. I think this will probably be an hour. It's storage room. What? I'm hoping this can squeeze around the 50 minute mark. Oh no, it did a big jump. Hey look Bert, it's a clothespin. I'll get it for you. Ernie is so you. kind. Normally the um, Bert and Ernie episodes, it's just Bert um, trying to talk Ernie out of whatever mischief is getting into, whatever crazy scheme Ernie's involved in. And Bert's just trying to tell him no. No, Ernie, no. This kind of thing of an elevator, it's like the flying elevator from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. The glass oh, elevator. Let's go. Pigeon coop. It's the same thing on repeat. Chicken leg, cheesecake, lollipops. There is one pigeon in the coop. The coop needs five. One. Five pigeons. Yeah, Bill Ory, famous Australian test cricketer there and are two commentator. In the coop. Also, one. absolutely loved breeding and racing pigeons as well. Not the most popular hobby there going are around. Three pigeons in the coop. One. There are four pigeons in the coop. One. And you can press a green button if you put too many. There in. are five pigeons in the coop. If you. Where's the trumpet? You got it. There are five pigeons in the coop. Use your. If you are enjoying this video as well, if you flick a quick like down the bottom, it definitely helps me out. If you comment, I would love to comment back. And if you subscribe, you're an absolute oh, legend. Let's go. Otherwise, you can check out the Crabman V Smile playlist. At the moment, about 26 games that I have that will be uploaded, and I'm looking to buy some more all the time. There's the trumpet. Hey, we did it! Now let's sort Bert's clothespins. Thank you for finding my clothespins. Please sort them by color. Put the clothespin in the box that's the same color. To choose a box, press one of the color buttons. Red, yellow, or blue. The V-Small controller has red, yellow, blue, and Hooray! green. Blue clothespin. Here's another one. It also has a big enter button and a Put massive joystick pin. that I find quite hard to control with just my finger. Terrific! Yellow clothespin. Here's another one. Put the clothespin. Can I have the later version with the smaller you colored got buttons? It. Red clothespin. Here's another one. There's an early version where the enter button Put was even bigger. Pin. It looked like a bit of like a foot. Terrific! Blue clothespin. Here's another one. Put the. I have the uh, the V Smile V Motion controller, which is a little Terrific. bit. Terrific! Red clothespin. Here's another one. 
put the Hooray! Yellow clothespin. Here's another one. Put the clothes. Look at the monobrow on Bert. Come on, Bert, get the tweezers out. Hooray! Red clothespin. Here's another one. Put the Terrific! Blue clothespin. Here's another one. How many more are there? Put the That's gotta be it. Terrific! Yellow clothespin. Oh, we're done. Hooray. Well done, Bert and Ernie. We did it. Thank you. We sorted all of Bert's clothespins. On our way to Sesame Street. Press the red button. Oh, what's the, what's the yellow rubber one? Ducky roll. Rubber ducky roll. On, let's go. Hey, Bert. It's Rubber Ducky World. We're riding a giant rubber ducky. Far out. Let's help Bert find his sponges. Please do. Thank you! Come on, let's go! Excellent finding! Come on, let's go! Look! Map! Cap! Bug! And jug! Please choose two things that rhyme. To choose the first thing, press one of the color buttons. We'll go with map and cap. Bug and jug Let's also see if rhyme. These things rhyme. Map. Cap. You got it. Map. And cap. End in the same sound. They rhyme. Bug. Rhymes with jug. Two. Oh no, I'm gonna land on it. Oh, I made it over. Come on, let's go! Most of these baseball games are pretty forgiving, although a couple of them have Look. been a little bit tough. Fox. Fox. Ten. And pen. We'll go perfect ten, Please Ty Dillinger. Choose. And a pen. Alphabet Park Adventure was a little bit let's tough. Let's see if these things rhyme. Ten. Pen. Ten and pen end in the same sound. They rhyme. Fox rhymes with fox. Two. Thank you. Come on, let's go. Here we go down the rainbow slide. I love the rainbow slide. Thank you. Okay, we can go left and right. Anything we have to avoid? Excellent finding! Come on, let's go! Thank you! I try and keep these as mostly a first playthrough as well as... Excellent finding! Please be careful! Press the... I probably... Press don't need to practice too Come much. On, let's go! In a game aimed at three to five year olds. Look! Can. Fan. Pig. And wig. I'm doing pig and wig, but sometimes I'll play the first five minutes just to get the hang of the game. Let's see if these things rhyme. Pig. Wig. Terrific! Pig. And wig. End in the same sound. They rhyme. Can rhymes with fan, too. What I do like about this game, though, is they're aiming to include on, let's go. a lot of educational bits Look. and it's lots of rhyming words. Jam, ham, mug, and rug. And there was quite a bit of counting in the first level. Some of these games, even though they're on smart tridges and they're supposed let's to be see educational. If these things rhyme. Jam, ham. Sometimes there's not a lot of educational content in the games. You got it. Jam and ham end in the same sound. They rhyme. 
mug rhymes with rug, too. Come on, let's go! Thank you! Look! Red Top Bed And Mop Definitely red for crab man And bed, bedtime Let's after this video Let's see if these things rhyme Red Bed You got it! Red and bed end in the same sound. They rhyme. Top rhymes with mop, too. Hold on, Bert, don't fall off. A sponge. Look. Car. Jar. Bun. And sun. Let's Bar see if these jar. things rhyme. Car. Jar. You got it. Car. And jar. End in the same sound. They rhyme. Bun. Rhymes with sun. Too. A little bit of artifact flickering happening as well. I don't know if that's just how the game is or... What I tends did. to happen? Oh, they're at the end. Is that the the smudges tend to get a little Yay, bit? Hey, we did it! Now let's sort Bert's sponges. Can do a little bit dirty over go. time. Thank you for finding my sponges. Please sort them by shape. Ooh, shapes. Put the sponge in the boat with the same shape sponges. To choose a boat, press one of the color buttons. Choose the triangle, square, or circle. I've had to clean a few of the cartridges with some ipropyl alcohol as well. And then they do tend to work, even Hooray! if they won't work first triangle, time. Triangle, sponge, here's another one. It's the circle. Got it! Circle! Sponge! Here's another one! Put the... You got it! Square! Sponge! Here's another one! If you're looking for cartridges as well, America and the UK seem to be where most of them are. You can pick them up. Triangle, sponge, here's another one. On eBay, fairly cheap, but here in Australia, some significant postage costs. Put the sponge. But I've managed to find a few so far. Love and Bert's top. Terrific! Circle, sponge, here's another one. Here's a decagon. Here's a nonagon. Hooray! Here's a septagon. Square sponge. Here's another one. Here's a dodecahedron. The... Now remember, kids out there, shapes are 2D, objects are 3D. Totally a lot of people get that wrong. Circle sponge. Here's another one. 2D shape, 3D object. Remember. Put the sponge. It's a crab man lesson Hooray! of the day. Square sponge. Here's another one. What the hell does this go for? This goes for a while. I think we might be in for a long video. 50 minutes, I reckon. Terrific! Triangle sponge. Here's another one. I mean, you know, because you can see it on YouTube, but I have no idea playing this through. Put the All I had in the was a five minute practice run, so I have never played this bit before. Terrific! Circle, sponge. We hey, did it. The we sorted all of Bert's sponges. Thank you.
To play Moonwalker, press the blue button. Come on, let's go. We've landed, we've landed. Hey, Bert, we're on the moon. Let's help Bert find his moonstones. Please do. Thank you. Come on, let's go. Use your joystick to move the spaceship. Gee, I've forgotten, but what does the moonstone evolve in Pokemon Red and Blue? Is it the Jigglypuff? Great. Into a Wigglytuff? It's been a long time Look, since I've played what it. Is it, Ernie? Something is missing. Which number goes between four and six? Is it nine, five, eight, or two? To choose the missing number, press one of the color buttons. Three, four, five, six. Use your joystick to move the spaceship. I do like the explanations, but I wish like, the if you'd played it once, you should just be able to, to skip the explanation. Well, please comment below what the moonstone's used for in um, Pokemon Red and Blue Look, and Yellow. What is it, Ernie? Something is missing. It's Which four. number goes between... Three and five. Is it four, seven, ten, or I'll bet you're a star. Hooray! Two, three, four, five. Use your joystick. I can't remember if I said it earlier, but this game has probably the most voice acting in any of the V-Smile games I've um, played so far. This is a lot of voice acting in it. Considering the VTech console, the V-Smile console is only really the power of a uh, Game Boy Advance. Thank you! So I don't even know any Game Boy Advance games that have this much voice acting. Great! Cool soundtrack as well. I'm digging the soundtrack. I don't know if I had to jump over that, but a moonstone. Look, what is it, Ernie? Something is missing. Which letter goes between B and D? Is it? B, M, C, or E. Terrific! A, B, C, D. Use your joystick to move. I was thinking in these games, it should tell you the phonic sound as well. So it should be like, at, the, k, d, as well. Seemed to be when I was a kid, phonics, phonics have gone right out the window. I never really learned phonics at all. But now phonics are back in a big oh, way in the 2020s. Is it, Ernie? Something is d missing. D Which e letter goes between C and E? Is it O, P, D, or E? Use your joystick to move the spaceship. Well, we're nearly done. This is coming out during the Beijing 2022 Olympics as well. So I've got a few games on a Winter Olympic playlist. You can check them out. If you've gotten this far and you came for some more hey, Crabman gaming. In a tunnel. Great. Let's help Bert find his moonstones. Use your joystick to move the spaceship. The Beijing Olympics might be a long distant memory by the time you watch this. But that's okay. The Winter Olympic game should still be there. Nagano, Salt Lake City. Great. Vancouver, Torino. Said I'm in the wrong order. Torino 2006, Vancouver 2010. Yeah, Pyeongchang 2018. Sochi 2014. 
Beijing 2022. Use your joystick to move the spaceship. Look, what is it, Ernie? Something is missing. Which number goes between eight and ten? Is it four, one, nine? Or it is definitely nine. You got it. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Use your joystick to. Now most of the other games there's a question mark button on the controller and it will tell you what to do if you press it, but in this game nothing happens, which is a little bit strange. Great. Nine meteorites. How many do I need? Ten, I reckon. Look, what is it, Ernie? Something is missing. Which letter goes between D and F? Is it U, I, E, or P? Use your joystick to move. There's the 10th meteorite. Surely there's not too many more. I can't see a life meter as well, so I assume if you hit that, it just gets you to try again. 10 was the magic number. We're into the double digits. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. There's Kratos and Quang. Hey, we did it! Now let's sort Bert's moonstones. It's like the Thank cookie must have gone wrong. My moonstones. Please sort them by size. Come on, let's go. And the Martian can help us. Yep, 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 yep. Put the moonstone in the box with the same size moonstones. To choose a box, press one of the color buttons. Yep, 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 yep. You got it. Small moonstone. Here's another one. Yep, 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 yep. Put the Definitely large. Yep, 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 yep. You got it. Large moonstone. Here's another one. Yep, 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 yep. Put the Yep, 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 yep. Okay, I've looked it up you while this bit is a little bit long and boring. Here's another one. Yep, 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 yep. I've looked up the Pokemon Moonstone evolutions for you. Yep, 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 yep. Terrific! Small Moonstone. Here's another one. Yep, so we've got yep, yep, Nidorina yep. to Nidder Queen, Nidorino to Nidder King, Clefairy to Clefable. I think that's the one I was thinking of. Oh, here we go. Jigglypuff to Wigglytuff. Yep, 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 yep. Skitty to Del Caddy. Small Moonstone. Here's another one. Yep, 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 yep. And Mana to Mashana. I don't know those Pokemon. Put. Yep, 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 yep. I really Hooray! played until. Small Moonstone. Here's another one. Yep, Pokemon yep, yep, yep. Gold and Silver. And then had a little dabble at Black and White. Yep, 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 yep. You got it. Why have they shot their friend out top? Here's another one. Yep, 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 yep. Been mucking around, not listening, locked outside in the cold. Without oxygen. Yep, 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 yep. You got it. Small moonstone. Here's another one. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. You got it. Large moonstone. Here's another one. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. You got it. We did it. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, the we trumpet out, and the trumpet wasn't happening at all. Stones. Thank you. Button. To play Dinosaur Island, press the green button. Come on, let's go.
Off to Dinosaur Island. We're collecting sticks. It's Dinosaur Island. <laughs> We've gone back in time, Bert. Wow, Ernie, you're right. Let's help Bert find his twigs. Please do. It's Bert and Ernie's Thank Chrono you. Trigger Come Adventure. On, let's go. You let's go, Chrono. It's time to save the world. Ah. Whoops. Back, back, back. Where is the stick? What was that? Uh-oh. We need some help. Choose the thing that will help us go across the valley. Is it the bridge, the slide, the boat, or the rope? To choose one of these things, press one of the color buttons. To be fair, we could use the rope. I want to go back and get that stick I missed. Terrific! The bridge can help us go across the valley. Okay, I couldn't go back. It's auto-walking me over the bridge. But that's okay. Let's go over the Yoshi egg. It was that giant Yoshi egg in Mario Kart 64. Always blocking you right before the end. Cool soundtrack in this level as well. Is it Lavos or Lavros in Chrono Trigger who's the oh, uh we need some help. Choose antagonist. The thing that will help us go across the lake. The boat. Where's the boat? Is it You got it. The boat can help us go across the lake. The Mr. Beaumont. Get on in. Feel the wind through your scalp. Oh, I love to put life jackets on. Have they got a flare? Thank you. Everybody do the dinosaur. I was always on at the school disco. Uh oh. We need some help. Choose the thing that will help us go across Is that the, the rope this time? Are they all the same things? Yeah. Is it the oh. bridge, the rope, the boat, or the ladder? To choose it's either the rope or the ladder. Things, Whichever one I one pick, it's going to be wrong. I knew it. Rope my way across. Oh, another bridge. I thought because we picked bridge already, we couldn't pick bridge again. I've been rumbled. The I'm not going to lie. Can help us go across the valley. It's happened to me before. I have been rumbled by these V-Smile games. I've been outspotted by a game aimed at three-year-olds. Honestly, it does not make me feel good. I nearly reset the game, played the whole thing again. But no, I'll take it. I'm not perfect. I was going to call myself the average Aussie gamer. I don't know why we have to go down. We can just keep jumping right, I reckon. But Crabman Gaming will do. Great! Got a good joke for you too. What's brown and sticky? It's a stick. Uh oh, we need some help. Choose the thing that will help us go up the cliff. Now we need the Indiana Jones and the square? Temple of Doom ladder. What a film. Although I don't think it's aged well. I tried to watch it a couple of years ago and I'm like, oof. This is really showing its early 90s age.
I don't know why I couldn't jump over it straight away. I had to wait for Bert. Come on, Bert. Hurry up, Bert. Yeah, let's go in the creepy cave. Thank you. That's definitely going to be fine. A cave. Where'd the light come from? Any drawings? Not sure how culturally appropriate they are. Oh, and they're coming to life. Yeah, I just pretend I didn't see that. Let's move on. It's not 2006 anymore. Thank you. We've got ourselves another stick. There's probably 10 sticks, but I missed one of the early sticks. It didn't let me go back. It's a problem with jumping. A twig. It's a problem with jumping. Please. Jump around, jump up, jump up and get down. Come on, Ernie. Oh, that's late, Ernie. It's getting past Crabman's bedtime. Nah, I'm enjoying it. It's been a good beast mile game, actually. Lots of variation. And a good length as well. Some of these are only like 20 minutes. When you get to Care Bears... Oh, we need some help. Choose the thing that will help us go down the line. Now it's the rock. rope. The Care Bears is 20 is minutes. The slide, the oh, slide. Bridge, the boat. Care Bears is 20 minutes with the Learning Zone games as well. So I'll play the Learning Zone games at the end. You got it. For 22 minutes. I think it was like 21 minutes with Learning Zone. Down the large rock. Especially if you've paid 15 or 20 dollars for these games. To be fair, they were probably quite expensive for what they were. But I am definitely enjoying them from a nostalgic lens obviously superseded now by iPads and other technologies no real need for a Great. games console specifically at kids this and the leap star kind of faded out towards the end of the 2000s the end of the noughties when the iPad came in I think 2010 was when the iPad was released so it was the kind of end of these consoles and the kind of advance of phones as well Uh-oh, we need some help. Choose the thing that will help us go across the valley. Is it the slide, the square stone, the rope, or the... I'm over the square stone. It's kind of killed off all the portable devices, really, apart from the Nintendo Hooray! Switch, which was a fantastic idea. The square stone can help us go across the valley. Love my Switch, need to play it just a little bit more. And then kind of the Steam Deck that's come out, but if you've seen it, that thing is absolutely enormous. Boss time. Use your joystick to move Bert and me. Rock, paper, scissors, like Alex Kidd. Play a bit of Yankin. We did it! Now let's sort Bert's twigs. What was Bert doing? Come on, Bert. Oh, it's small or large again. This isn't very exciting. You need more than two Thank options. You, you need to order all the size. Twigs. Please sort them by length. Put the twig in the basket with the same size twigs. To choose a basket, press one of the color buttons. That isn't a twig, though. That's just a picture of a twig. Hooray! Long twig. Here's another one. What's only giving you the short twig or the long twig? The short twig. Hooray! Short twig! Here's another one. Bert needs to collect something valuable, like retro video <laughs> games. Tesla shares. Hooray! Short twig! Here's Bitcoin. another one. Dogecoin. So we'll be into the Learning Zone games after this. This should be the end of the Learning Adventure. Hooray! Four Short Learning Zone games. Twig. Here's another one. Let's see if we can cap it out around a 50 minute mark, maybe 55 minutes. Put Currently ticking near the 40 minute Hooray! mark for me. Short twig. Here's another one. Not much editing required for this game though, so just trimming out probably about a minute or so. 
put the twig in the basket with the same size twigs. To choose a basket, press one of the color buttons. Yeah, I did that. I don't know why I explained it again. Hooray! Long twig. Here's another one. There's so many V-Smile games to check out as well if you haven't checked them out. Blue's Clues. Long twig. Here's another one. Alphabet Park. Alphabet Park Adventure, Hooray! The Backyardigans, Long Lion twig. King, Bob Here's the Builder, Cinderella, Dora the Explorer, Put Finding Nemo, SpongeBob, The Wiggles. They're all there. Check Hooray! them out on the playlist. Short twig. Elmo, Elmo's Adventure, Mickey Mouse. We did it. We sorted all of Bert's twigs. Thank you for finding my twigs. brought back my collections. Thank you. You did a great job helping find Bert's stuff. Thanks. You bet we did. Let's go on an adventure with our imaginations. In the sky, in the tub, on the moon, or way back in time. Come back and play with us again soon. Goodbye. See you later. Bye-bye. Press the green button to play in the learning zone. Here we go. To play what comes next, press the red button. To play what's the first letter, press the yellow button. To play what time is it, press the blue button. To play what will fit, press the green button. Come on, let's go. Wanna play a fun game? Sure, Ernie. Let's play. What, what happens to do? first when you knit a scarf? To choose a picture, press one of the color buttons. Hooray! You got it! Yeah, this one you can pick the things without waiting for the explanation. Hooray! We're doing sequencing. Great! That's the right order to knit a scarf. I think Bert should knit one for Ernie. This is fun! Let's play again! What happens first when you make a bowl of cereal? To... You got it! Strawberries? Hooray! That's weird. No strawberries in my cereal. Weebix, honey, milk. Now what? Terrific! Great! That's the right order to make a bowl of cereal. Oh, those Weebix minis. I love those two. Little bits of blackberry. This is fun! In. Let's play again. Or blackberry. What happens first when you make a salad? To choose a picture, press one of the color buttons. Just wouldn't know, wouldn't know. No, I know. You Feel like a good it. salad. Get some lettuce. Some carrot. Get the feta now, cheese what? out. You got it. Bit of onion. No tomato in there. Get get rid of the tomato. I don't like tomato. Great. It's hard That's the right when I have a salad a because, because salad. I don't like lots of things that go in a salad. I don't like tomato. I don't like cucumber. Uh, I don't like uh, capsicum or bell pepper or whatever you call them this in the UK. Fun. Let's play uh, again. In the US. <laughs> what was that? What happens first when you grow a plant? To choose a picture. Totally and we pick the upside down hat. Now what comes next? What do life cycle of a plant? What do plants need to grow? Sunlight, air, nutrients. Now what comes last when you grow a plant? To choose. Totally Great. That's the right order to grow a plant.
and they need some soil. Thanks for playing. Would you like to play again? I was waving at the screen. You couldn't see me, but I was. Button. To play, watch the first letter. Press the yellow button. Come on, let's go. <laughs> hey, bird, I've got another great game. Sure, Ernie. Let's play! Find the first letter of the word nose. To choose a I'm glad letter, he told me, because I couldn't work out buttons. what it was. I was like, is it a hose? Didn't look like a rose. Yes, the first letter of nose is N. Every nose has its thorns. <laughs> this is fun! Let's play again. Find the... Yes, the first letter of pen is P. <laughs> this is fun! Let's play again! I do like you only have to pick it six times as well. Some yes, of these learning the zone games... of boat is B. Make you repeat the activity ten times. It goes forever. This is fun! Let's play again. Send Find hook. the first letter of the word hook. To Send a letter. hook. Hook has been sent. Terrific. Yes, the first letter of hook is H. You don't even know me. This is fun. Let's play again. <laughs> Yes, the first letter of ham is H. <laughs> this is fun! Let's play again! I'm glad Bert's having a good time. Terrific! Yes, the first letter of hat is H. And the sound is huh. Thanks for playing. I'm not sure if you should take a trumpet in a bathtub. Would you like to play again? Button. To play, what time is it? Press the blue button. Come on, let's go. Hey, bird! Let's see what happens at different times of the day. Which one happens at nighttime? To choose what happens at nighttime, press one of the color buttons. Well, what's happening is the nighttime one looks like they're just eating. You got it! I eat dinner at nighttime. Okay. Which one happens in the morning? To choose what happens in the morning. Press well, I one reckon of the it's color eat buttons. cereal. You got it. I eat breakfast in the morning. Don't drink yep, 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 orange yep, juice yep, with yep, your cereal. Which one happens in the morning? To choose what happens in the morning. Hooray! I wake up in the morning. Well, you hope so. Which one happens in the afternoon? To choose what happens in the afternoon, press one of the color buttons. Well, what's the blue one? What is he doing? Just doing the washing up? You got it! I Ooh, clean was up worried. after lunch in the afternoon. Okay, I clean up at random times. Which one happens in the afternoon? To choose what happens uh, in the afternoon, are you at school press in one the of afternoon? the color buttons. I learn in school in the afternoon. But not in the morning. Children learn best in the morning. Come on, Ernie. You have to learn in the morning as well. Which one happens at nighttime? To choose what happens. Hooray! I sleep at nighttime. That one was quite weird. Thanks for playing. I'm glad Would I got like them all right again? because I was really worried. 
To play what will fit, press the green button. Come on, let's go! Hey, Bert! There are things missing on the wall. Wow, Ernie, you're right! <laughs> Look, a coat. Find the place where it fits on the wall. To choose the place where this fits, press one of the color buttons. It's Santa's jacket. Oh, how many stars are there? Great! You found the right hole for the coat. It's like a Kenny Omega match at the Tokyo Dome. It was like 14 stars. Omega Kazuchika Okada. Look, a bag. Find the place where it fits on the wall. That is a lot of stars. Terrific! That Great. is a lot. You found the right hole for the bag. Melt has had a great time. Great! You found the right hole for the pen. I'm not sure if it was a pen or a pencil. It might have been one of those fancy pencils. Let's I'll tell try you a wrestling another joke. part of this case. He said, what is the most powerful weapon in all of wrestling? The eraser. It's a 2000s minivan that everyone used to have with that sliding door in the it. middle. Great! You found the right hole for the van. For any family larger than five before SUVs took over. Look! Hooray! Great! You found the right hole for the lock. For the hurt lock. Uh. Hooray! Great! Ten past. You found the right hole for the Ten. lock. It's kind of hard to see. Let's try another part of this cave. Look at Ernie with his Nike kicks on. Look at him. Bert's got some orange kicks. These guys were rocking high tops before high tops were cool. A rug. A magic carpet. Hooray! Great! You found the right hole for the rug. A whole new world. Great film, Aladdin. Look, a king. Find a small king. You got it. One of Great. my favorites you growing up, the Aladdin. Right hole for the king. Along with the Lion King. Two of my absolute favorites. Where's the last thing? Oh, there it is. Look, a uh, tree. You got it. Great. You found the right hole for the tree. Twelve stars. Let's try another part of this cave. A uh, skate. Find the place where it fits on the wall to ch Oh yeah, speed dating. I'd be better off you speed found skating. The right for the skate. I don't think much much if you know what that's from. It's a UK TV show. One of Crabman's favorites. You got it. Great. You found the right hole for the stamp. Or pizza. Check it out if you haven't seen it. It's awesome. Maybe if you're over 15. Definitely not a G. We're done. Great. 12 you stars. Found the right hole for the glue. In the Tokyo Dome. I think we're done. This could be the end. Thanks for playing. Goodbye. Would you like to play again? To play, what comes well, next? it has been Press Crabman from Crabman button. Gaming. If you have to enjoyed the video, the click a quick like down the bottom. The if you comment, I'll comment back. Play, if you subscribe, you're an absolute legend. And check out the V Smile playlist on the channel. Otherwise, get ready for Blue's Clues next. And have a wonderful day.